Engineer Mohammed Haruna, Executive Vice Chairman, National Agency for Science and Engineering Infrastructure, says government is set to partner with China to commence production of Nigeria-made transformers by 2020. According to him, the partnership with the Chinese government through the Great China Wall seeks to end the power challenge facing Nigeria. He said the agency was optimistic to launch the transformer for market use in no distant time. Let me first and foremost uh, be grateful to the uh, our chairman, uh, President Muhammad Buhari, and his government for supporting us, for giving us go-ahead to explore means that the country can proclip uh, in its power predicament because of the belief of government that for sustainable power supply in the country, the nation must be producing some components, some equipment, some machine needed in the power sector by itself. We came to China as a result of the open door and collaborative policy of the Chinese government that introduced what they call CAD Fund, Chinese Africa Development Fund. So we started applying and followed the process. Uh, we thank God for the approval of even the former government of uh, uh, President Bele Jonathan, who signed the agreement and later on was ratified and approved for continuation by the current administration of President Muhammad Buhari. The uh, agreement is to ensure that Nigeria is able on its, on, by itself to produce world-class uh, power transformers and distribution transformers from its design to the material selection and production to its installation, commissioning, and maintenance. And as a result of this collaboration, we currently have 60 uh, uh, well-qualified to learn the areas of engineers and technicians in China that are specializing in all the aspects of this production. So with the collaboration of the Chinese government, Nigeria is having its own version. The final component is we are manufacturing solar uh, modules in Karshi, but we import certain raw material. The most important raw material, the solar cells, are now produced in Nigeria. Haruna explained that from the total sum of over $307.5 million, China was contributing 85% of the sum, which amounts to over $261.4 million. He said Nigeria would contribute the remaining 15% of the sum, that is $46.1 million, which the Nigerian government had started paying installmentally. The Chinese are providing this support. In fact, 85% of the fund required for these three projects uh, is being provided by the Chinese government through this Chinese Africa Development Fund. So this is the collaboration and it is uh, very good for Nigeria because it will help us produce substantial components of local content in power sector. The project has already kick-started. Mm. The training is according to the work plan because our system is such that these 60 trainees, they will be the one to participate in the installation of the facilities in Nigeria. They have started training in uh, September, and the training is in various uh, duration. Some people's training will be six months. Some uh, engineers will, will be trained for four months while some will be trained for three months, depending on the areas of their specialization. We don't want the Chinese to come wholeheartedly and do the installation for us. Our own engineers will be trained adequate to come and do the installation for ease of sustainability and maintenance. It is our hope that uh, if things go as scheduled, depending of course availability of uh, funds from our own end, by February, March next year, machines will have started arriving. We will not start producing by February, March because the factory is able to take two to three years.